Thunder Toads. This is Derek from Classic Game Room, and by now it's it's no secret that I am a huge metalhead. That meaning I basically live for heavy metal. Not that my head is, you know. I mean, I mean, I have I have a human skull. And today I I wanted to share a bit of that passion with you. So it's 1991. It's Voivod. It's Angel Rat. And yes, Voivod lives. So Angel Rat is the sixth album from the legendary Canadian metal band Voivod. And this is actually a really significant album in their catalog. Uh, it came two years after Nothing Face, which was this you know, hyper-complex, insanely clinical, almost inhuman sounding, progressive thrash metal opus. Uh, in a lot of ways, Angel Rat was a complete departure from that. But if you really think about it, uh, this album continues the progression that Voivod had been undergoing since their album Killing Technology. It just took a slightly unexpected and, frankly, bizarre road. Now, this album sees Voivod lean toward their progressive influences a bit more than their metal influences. I mean, this is an incredibly trippy, spacey, psychedelic record. Um, you know, and it's characterized more by disharmonic riffs, really trippy melodies, and much looser and more concise songwriting. And, uh, you know, Voivod's late and great guitar player Piggy, there he is right there, rest well Piggy, uh, you know, he shines here as always, but Angel Rat is more about the songs and the hooks than his, uh, you know, crazy, insane riffing, which was the focus on a lot of the prior records. And of course, it's also a real departure conceptually, so it doesn't have that space-age futuristic theme, uh, but the songs are still, you know, very sci-fi oriented, and they still have that, that otherworldly sound that's so characteristic of Voivod. And what I really love about Angel Rat is that it's, it's like this, it's like this bizarre collection of just really surreal stories. So, for example, The Prow is about this pirate who's paying homage to his ship. And, you know, it even uses the sound of ocean waves to drive the point home. But it, it has this really awesome break in the middle of the song uh, where there are, like, accordions playing. Uh, it just, it paints such a vivid picture musically. Now, there's also Twin Dummy, which is a personal favorite and perhaps the creepiest song Voivod has ever written. Uh, you know, it's told from the perspective of a circus dummy uh, who gets left behind when the circus leaves town, and the music provides this, this really upbeat contrast to the lyrics, which, as you can see, are just bizarre. For example, uh, Dummy says, I have dreams, frightening screams, I have dreams, and then, of course, that haunting chorus, the circus left without me, and I'm alone with you now. I mean, ugh. I didn't sleep for weeks in 1991. So the music matches these really surreal themes perfectly, uh, but so does the cover. Uh, it, it, it's like it's like a circus starring outcasts from all over the cosmos. Uh, there's the pirate, and there's the dummy with that carnival-like font at the top. Very creepy. And, uh, and you know, for all the things that this album changed. I mean, it still sounds like Voivod. It still progresses and moves forward, and frankly, that's always been the point of Voivod. Uh, there's, there's so much character on this album. It's so unique, it's so distinct, and to me, that's what makes it so Voivod. And if you're a fan of progressive metal, oh boy, you gotta hear this. This album is highly recommended. It's Voivod, it's Angel Rat, and uh, boy. No one likes a creepy dummy. The circus left without me, and I'm alone with you now. That's horrifying.